hi guys welcome back to my channel my name is Patrice if this is your first time clicking on my video don't forget to give this a subscribe and a like so yes last week I had a good week in weigh-in so this is all about slimming well so if you're not interested in slimming well you can click off if you want to still hear what I've got to say you can still watch and give us a like anyway anyway so I went to Slimming World and um, yeah it was a good week I will give you the results so this week's video is one that I thought of when I was like um, when I was like in the bath who goes on their phone in the bath I've dropped it in the bath before it's a pain so I might be looking down on my phone so forgive me so right let's get into this so I'm gonna do the top 10 annoying things that people say to you when you are losing weight have you come across any of those annoying things and i'll give you my weight loss at the end of this video so you got to stick up stick around to watch so literally top 10 annoying things that people say to you when you're losing weight if you've got some that i haven't mentioned comment down below some of yours um, what you've incurred, incur, incur, <laughs> can't get my words out, what you've come across and, and let me know. So, number one, let's get it, let's get it, let's, I'm so not prepared, I can't, oh, I can't put my notepad, uh, right, it's just, uh, so, so this is just my top 10 tips of annoying fit thing and if anyone who knows me who's watching it this isn't a go or a dig or anybody but it's just like mind your business mind your business are you joking top 10 you're too skinny so look, number one you're too skinny it's like <sighs> but if i was fat it would be like oh you're really fat like my mom would be like oh you're too skinny but then on the other spectrum of the things she would be like oh you've got a bit chubby you can see where you've put the weight on why why are you getting so fat uh number two you must be at your goal weight by now did i announce it did i announce that i was at my goal weight no you must be at your goal weight number th three you don't le need to lose weight anymore. Um, yes, I do. Because I am still going. I have a target. I want to get to a healthy weight. And, and my favourite one out of all of them. You, look, you will look gaunt if you lose any more weight. No, I won't look gaunt because my skin won't be hanging off I won't look gaunt you never looked overweight and it's like what do you want me to do carry around a sign on me that says I am overweight look at me look at me I'm overweight yes I was overweight but I never carried myself as an overweight person so you wouldn't know unless I told you and if I never went um to do a weight loss program and went to slimming well no one would know no only me that w would know that i was overweight so you couldn't really tell but i was i know i was but yeah uh you've lost all your curves it's like no i haven't they're there but they just look nicer no i'm only joking i haven't lost my curves it's just that things look a lot better on me and yeah, it might look a bit straighter, but I like the way I look. Um, you're pretty the way you are. When did we have this discussion that I was ugly? I am not losing weight because I'm not trying to, there's, these are two different things, looks and thingy. Uh, you can be overweight and pretty uh, but what's my way what's my looks got to do with anything it's like yeah 
uh, I don't even know what number that is. Uh, I think that's number five. Number six. Uh, no, six, seven. Uh, I'm so disjointed because I'm looking at my phone. Excuse me. Um, you waste away. So number seven. You will waste away. I think that's number seven. And no, I won't waste away because if I waste away, then I will just die. And you're, and I'm not anorexic or anything like. I'm trying to be healthy because also at 38, my grandmother was di diagnosed with um, diabetes, and that's how old I am, 38. And she was diagnosed with diabetes. She she died. She died like years and years ago. But at 38 and a really um i don't know what's the one that you take insulin you have to self inject your insulin every day um that's the one that she had and um yeah i don't want to and diabetes running my family stroke high blood pressure and it's like i don't want any of that so that's why uh you need more meat on your bones someone said that to me uh, last week actually you need more meats on your bone on your bones because I just said oh, I feel a bit cold and they're like oh you need more meat on your bones um, and also one of the um, the worst things as well annoying things you've got the saboteurs who are like go on eat that my mum's the worst one go on eat that a little bit of that won't hurt or one meal um, out won't hurt it probably wouldn't won't hurt but this is my choice my journey my life so this is what I choose to do so no I don't want it no thank you no thank you and my next one is the, the best one I think I like is um, how does slimming well work and then when you spend like 10 minutes explaining it to them and then they won't they'll go oh i couldn't do that then so i've wasted like 10 minutes explaining that to you and now you're telling me you couldn't do it um yeah so those are my top 10 tips i hope that was 10 because i wasn't keeping track of the numbers so da -da 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 -da, drum roll this week i lost a whopping three pounds so in total i've lost 40 pounds and i have got 11 and a half pounds until target until my goal target weight um yeah so this is a quick video so next week um i only need two pounds to get to my three stone award so two pounds so i'll be having so i'd have lost 42 pounds 42 pounds so next week i could have lost 42 pounds but 40 pounds i can't believe it but this has been not an overnight thing it's been from september so if this is your first time watching this video and you haven't seen any of my other video this isn't an overnight thing this has been things through september through going away through doing loads of different things christmas and i've still managed to pick myself back up 42 pounds and not 42 pounds 40 pounds i've lost in total and hopefully next week i will get to 42 pounds so when i get to my three stone that's 42 pounds for people that don't work in stones i will show you where i started from and where i am currently so that's next week video so don't forget to look out for that and thank you so much for clicking on this video don't forget to give me a like subscribe to my channel and also comment down below and let me know your most uh, annoying thing people say whether you're doing slimming well any weight loss journey annoying things that people say to you because that drives me crazy and a bonus one for you actually um a bit of story time quickly i don't want to be keep you too long my next door neighbor i got out of my car my next door neighbor that that's when i was had lost two stone 
and I think I was just you know when you lose weight and your stomach is like the hardest place for it to go so I think I was like shuffling with my top and then she went you're not pregnant again it's like no I'm not oh I hate that but anyway that's a little story time yeah and I was like I lost two stone how am I pregnant again and I've already got two kids twins I don't want any more kids are expensive Ugh. anyway yeah so that's that I hope you enjoy this quick little vi video I uh, hope it's not too rambly comment down below you I really want to hear everybody else's comment and experience that they've encountered with people um, yeah don't forget to give this a, a thumbs up like and subscribe thank you see you next week cross everything for me